So today I'm going to do a story time about when I was talking to a demon. I am not joking guys. This is really, really a true story. So stay tuned and um, get some popcorn ready because this is going to be a very scary story time. Okay guys, so this is the story of what happened. So I'm, I'm not going to use his real name. We're going to call him Alex. So. I was talking to Alex on this thing called Keek, if anybody have it. It was called Keek Messenger, so I was talking to him on Messenger. I have no clue where I met him from, like I really don't remember, I honestly don't remember. Like I'll try to remember, but it's like so hard, I can't remember where I met him from, which is really, really strange. <sighs> anyway guys, um, I messaged him on Keek. And he was fine, you know, it was cool, regular conversations. Nothing seemed out of the ordinary, but like, when I would message him on Skype, like I messaged him on Skype one day, we was talking about something, I don't know, we was talking about something. So, Alex said that he will be right back. He's going to play, like, well, he didn't say he was going to play. He said he was going to play, um, pool. I'm sorry, I, I totally forgot the name for a second. But he said that he was going to play pool. So I, I'm thinking, I'm guessing that he has a pool in his house or something. So he said that he was going to play pool. A few minutes later, his eye is like red. Like, one of his eyes were like really red. And it had some sort of pattern in his eyelid, like his eyeball. This is, this, guys, I am not joking. This is a really, really true story. Like, he had a pattern in his eyeball, and I asked him what happened, and he said, Oh, a, a, a cute stick went in my eye, went in my eyeball or something. I didn't really believe it, because how could your eye just get red like that out of nowhere? It just seemed so out of the ordinary. This really didn't make sense at all. Also, guys, another thing, he had an identical twin brother that looked exactly like him, like, it looked exactly like him, so I felt that was kind of cool, too, that he had a twin, like, I have a twin, but anyway, like, the first time, the first time I met him, he was cool, but, like, just a lot of weird things were happening, like, also, he told me that, wait, let me, let me restart, okay, so, if you guys didn't hear this thing called Siri, where you message people, like, well, this this thing called this thing called Siri, where like you, it repeats your voice, like it's like a voice thing, like a voice thing, like it reads your messages, you, it repeats your voice, and it's this thing called Siri. So he told me that he used that. So what was weird about it was he actually showed me a picture of how Siri looks. So like I was like freaked out because how could you know a picture of how Siri looks? So I was like really really confused. And when he showed me the picture, it was like a picture of a monster or something. I was like really really scared. But 
that wasn't the weirdest thing that he like told me or showed me. Something else was weird was that he would tell me that there was this demon that comes in his room at night. Like seriously, guys, this is not a joke. I am not joking. This was really, really a true story. There was, he told me that, Alex had told me that a demon comes in his room every night and it's hard for him to sleep. Like a tall demon. And when he had told me that, I was like really, really freaked out. Like, how could that happen? Like, how could it happen? It was just really, really weird. And another thing was, I'm trying to remember. Wait, okay. Another thing that um, was so strange was one day I had messaged him. It was a normal, normal message. Everything was fine. He seemed like, you know, he seemed normal at the time. But like a few minutes later, he like, he like changed. Like he was sending me messages that he wouldn't normally send. Like it was really, really weird messages to like, like spiritual and like sinister messages. It was really, really scary. So when when he had sent me that, I was like really, really freaked out. Like and I was asking him like, and then and another thing, I had I had asked him. I was like, Alex, is this you? And then and then the message was, oh, no, this is not me. This is not Alex anymore. And I was like, what? How? Was like how? You're not Alex anymore? Like I was so so freaked out. So when that happened, I immediately blocked him because I was so freaked out. And then another thing, like, the other thing, when, when me and my sister was talking about this, we actually thought that a demon was going to come from where he lived at all the way to our house. So I was like really, really freaked out because he, he had told me that if I continue to talk to him, that the demon is going to come from where he live at all the way to where I live at now. So I was like really freaked out. Guys, I really think that he has multiple personalities. I think he has like multiple personalities. One minute he's regular, the next minute he's different kind of person you don't really know and it's like really, really weird. I was like so like freaked out. And also, also another thing, I looked it up, I looked it up, like his pattern and his eye, I looked it up online and it means that a demon, it means something that has to do with a demon. So basically a demon was is in his eye, not, not joking guys, a demon is actually in his eye. I really, I really think that something is like seriously wrong. This is not a joke guys, I was extremely terrified. I actually thought I actually thought that I actually thought that a demon was actually gonna come from where he lives at all the way to here. So guys, this is basically the story time. I'm not sure if I missed anything. I think I got everything. Yeah, I think I got everything. But that's basically the story guys. This is not a joke. I'm not joking. This is really serious. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed my story time. Please give this story time, this video a thumbs up and also subscribe. Also, if you guys aren't notified to our channel, please notify now so that you can see our videos right when they come out. Stay tuned for more guys. Bye.